What's going on guys? Today I'm here to talk about the newer dimmable bicolor LED lights. Lighting is one of the most important aspects of filmmaking that a lot of amateurs forget about. LED lights have become the most practical and efficient way for filmmakers on the go to get the quality of lighting that they want. They're portable, they're battery powered, they use low energy, and they don't get hot. But they can be very expensive. The best option that I've found are these newer LED lights. I absolutely love these lights. First off are the perks. One of the greatest things about this set is the portability. Each light comes with a padded carrying case, which is awesome. They're only about a square foot in size, and they can be battery powered, which is huge. The batteries are not included, but it comes with a cable to plug into the wall. The cable is long enough, but in most cases, you'll probably need an extension cable when you're going on shoots. One huge perk of this cable is that it's only a two prong cable, which means it's way more accessible to different outlets and also different extension cables. And they're super lightweight. I brought these up to the studio today, no issue. Really awesome, really small, really lightweight. Next up on the perks list is usability. These lights are really easy to set up. This set comes with light stands included, which is awesome. The stands are super lightweight and easy to set up. One of the greatest usability perks about this lighting kit is the dimmer and temperature control. Having this on a set of lights this cheap is awesome. You can dim the light as low or bright as you need it to, and you can also adjust how yellow or white the color is. This is super cool and you can make a lot of different looks by just changing the color of the lights and also the white balance on your camera. I'm no lighting expert, but these lights seem pretty accurate compared to a lot of the cheaper, smaller, battery-powered LEDs that I use that give off sort of a greenish hue. The spread of these lights is pretty awesome, especially when you throw some diffusion on it like I did on my key light right here. The size and power of these lights is obviously not as strong as a lot of the other leading LED lights on the market, but you get what you pay for. These lights are pretty cheap, but I am completely satisfied with how bright they can get. They're obviously not single source LED lights. They're made up of a lot of very small LED lights put together, which in most cases isn't a problem, but if you want really sharp shadows, you're not gonna get that with these lights. One downside is the stands don't come with a carrying case, which is a little bit of a bummer, they're really not hard to carry around, but I figured since they included cases for the lights, the least they could do is include a carrying case for stands, but also when you're using the battery power on these lights and the battery starts to get low, the light will shut off, but if you turn it off and back on, it works again for a while until it shuts off again. I don't know why that is. I'd much rather just have the battery die when it dies, I guess, but Strange, strange quirk with this, with, with, with this kit. In conclusion, these lights are fantastic. They're small, they're easy to use, they're bright, powerful, battery powered, and just really perfect for any on the go filmmaker. These are perfect for shooting interviews, going on location, and not wanting to carry a ton of gear around with you, but having the right tools for the job. And as far as price goes, they're an absolute steal. I snagged a set of two of these lights off Amazon for only 140 bucks. Getting two of these lights for only 140 bucks is a steal. If you're looking for an entry-level lighting kit, whether it's for your video business, your photography business, starting a YouTube channel, I'd say these are the ones to go for. I really can't recommend these lights enough. Thanks for watching, guys. I'll put a, a link to these lights in the description below. And if you like this kind of filmmaking content, behind the scenes stuff, click subscribe. We're gonna have more coming. And if you wanna see these lights in action, check out uh, the short film, which is also linked below. Thanks, guys. I'll see you next time. Thank you.